and it would be so magically unpredictable, but at the same time so incredibly faded, just like the best love stories are. That's right, Taylor. The best love stories are definitely unpredictable, and that's just what happened to her BFF and newlywed husband. Taylor drops everything to be the maid of honor in her best friend's wedding, and we have all the details right here. Today's episode of Newsfeed is brought to you by T-Mobile. With double the LTE coverage, you can know it all from almost anywhere. So you thought Taylor Swift's squad was full of A-list celebrities? Well, you were wrong. One of her friends goes way, way back when they were babies, before there was Selena Gomez and Carly Claus. Taylor met Britney Mac when she was just 10 days old, and they've been best friends ever since. So when asked to be the maid of honor in her wedding, of course, she couldn't turn that off her day. She was my partner in crime at Brownie's sleepaway camp, <laughs> and she was my date to the Grammys. The singer posted a few pics from the wedding in Pennsylvania last week on her Instagram, and OMG guys, I am dying from the cuteness. Captioning one freshman year, the two look like they're playing a game of dress up, and then switching to this one with the caption senior year. I cannot handle how adorable these two are, and if you haven't already watched Britney and her husband's wedding video, it's a definite must. Showcasing the rehearsal, wedding ceremony, and the reception, it might just be the best wedding video ever. Well, second to mine, just saying. My favorite accomplishments of my entire life is that everything in my life has changed, except for me and Brittany. Taylor certainly brings the tears in her maid of honor speech, and I mean, really, is there anything this girl cannot do? And little did either of us know that Prince Charming for Brittany would be the kid that sat next to me in class with the bowl cut and the Lego lunch <laughs> Well done, Taylor. Telling People Magazine, quote, I've never been a maid of honor before. I think Taylor did an amazing job, especially for her first time being a maid of honor, but what do you guys think? Let us know in the comments section below, or you can always tweet me at Jackie Idanisi. And when you're done with that, make sure you click in this box right over here to catch up on Dirty Laundry to see what your favorite stars rocked on the Oscars red carpet. And hey, while you're at it, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for checking in with me today. I'm your host, Jackie Idanisi, and I'll see you guys next time. For more clever videos, click to the left to check out a list of best Oscar moments, and over to the right to see six delicious, crazy burritos on cheat day. Thanks again to T-Mobile for sponsoring this episode. Click to the right to stay in the know almost anywhere you go with double the LTE coverage.